Albuquerque man is hoping to inspire others to do their part in being environmentally friendly. And while he calls his contribution unconventional, it really doesn't matter how you chip in to protect the earth. News 13's Fernando Lopez shows us. Bob Baylor says it just made sense. Oh, I went and looked at them and they were all expensive. They all used gas. They were noisy. And I didn't like any of that. Like many homeowners, he was in the market for a new lawnmower. Unhappy with his options, he decided to take matters into his mm. own hands. He got a hold of a broken down machine and saved it from the scrap heap. I bought those panels for 10 bucks a piece at the flea market. This now 10 year old creation runs solely on the sun's rays. It's not very pretty, but I use it all the time. Baylor is a retired and, uh, technician and took up solar of... as a hobby. Now his weekly yard trim turns heads. Uh, they stop. I've had several people stop uh, and uh, ask me where I got it, um, where can they get one. He says if you do right. find an official one for sale, it'll cost you a pretty penny. Here's how you start it. With the flick of a single switch. I like it because it doesn't annoy my neighbors. Baylor can take care of business. And then it sits around in the sun for a week. And by that time, it's charged and ready to do it again. He says he knows his way of living green is off the beaten path. I don't think I'm going to save the world by building a solar lawnmower. But if everybody took a few steps to reduce our use, it would make a lot of difference. Fernando Lopez, KRQE News 13. Baylor says he would consider commercializing his creation, but he doesn't have any plans in the works to do that right now.